just gonna get my Elgato set up here. It's nice to see other people hyped over the games revealed. Yeah. I think it's the card itself. I mean, at least that might be slightly easier to deal with, I feel like, than having to, like, replace the SD card reader itself. Um, I just don't know what exactly... Like, would it just be your saves on there? I don't know what on the Switch saves to the SD card. And what it... What doesn't, you know? Um... So, yeah. Welcome back into some more Rebirth. Last time, uh, we made it to Cosmo Canyon. Uh, we were definitely talking yesterday about the kind of weird... Strange... Just ish around this place. It's a really cool location, but there's a lot of weird... Weird stuff. It saved the system. Only games are saved to the SD card. And you can just re-download those from your, um... Your thing, right? From your, uh, like, eShop? I'm pretty sure, at least. I don't know how this works. <laughs> um, I hope that you're able to get it sorted. Yeah, there you go. I think you're fine. It's just getting a different SD card, maybe. Um, but yeah, so pretty much uh, we had the like lantern festival thing here, which had some weird stuff with Aerith going on. Uh, our next big story beat is Buchenhagen wants to show Red 13 something or not a key something. Um, and this should be kind of an interesting section. I also want to go play more piano today. I pray that the planet watches over and keeps all of you from harm on your journey. I'm glad to know that Aerith has friends like you to keep her company. Like who? Like, okay, sorry. <laughs> I have feelings about this. Today's experience was surely the will of the planet. May you cherish it always. This Nintendo Direct is a blessing in disguise because for some reason I fell into the rabbit hole of watching both you and other streamers play the first Pikmin game and I'm generally considering buying all the games. They're fun. Pikmin is a really fun time. <laughs> Well then, shall we proceed? Uh, but I thought this door was sealed so that none may enter. Why, yes, and by my own hand, no less. However, you've a trial to undertake. I do? If you wish to prove yourself and become a Watcher of the Veil, that is, I presume you are prepared. Yeah. I will also require your assistance in carrying out the trial. Much danger awaits within, and I wish to ensure his safety. When you're ready, simply say the word. All right, let's do it. Yeah, this is a pretty go. cool section. Jeez, I think they had some security. <laughs> now we follow the cave where it leads, deep as it will take us. The fallout vault door, it kind of is, yeah. <laughs> they take the section slowly. So we do have... <laughs> I was talking about this with Affection earlier today. We do have uh, about a week left of, of streams for me to finish this before Luigi's Mansion 2. Um, there's the ending, which I would love to get done in one stream, but that would probably be a very, very long stream. Which is not, you know, obviously impossible. It's just a little bit more difficult for me. Um, but then we don't really have that much more... left like there's another section after this but it's a smaller one i'd argue a lot of story though also random can i say i hope that you had a good Has trip Nanny now told you anything about his parents yet no they were watchers both of them but they couldn't have been any more different when our village came under attack my mother fought with courage, 
with honor. She faced the enemy and laid down her life to save us. My father, though, he turned tail and ran. He was a coward. So then, you still haven't forgiven him. Why would I? Oh, oh. I see. Captain said before takeoff that the plane had a malfunction. Oh my god, no. Well, I hope it was a smooth trip then. <laughs> From this point onward, only two may proceed. He who shall undertake the trial and his observer. Who's gonna observe? I'll do it. Ho, 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 ho. Uh, that would render the trial meaningless. But if not him... Ah, you do nicely. Me? Him? Really? At least pretend not to hate me. Oh, oh, oh. Whenever you're ready. Ready. Oh, I kind of, I don't know. Barrett and Red have like a cute thing going on, even if they don't want to admit it. Are we ready to see Red have a seat? Oh. <laughs> there we go. Alright, I have not looked at this in a while, so I should probably... Man. Almost at your point. Very end of chapter 11 for me. You could run there right now. Yeah, I haven't looked in here. <laughs> Right, um, max HP. I should probably make sure I have things for, oh no, we have things for Barrett. We're good. Static shock, I'm not too fussed about. That's with Aerith. MP recovery rate up. Max HP, elemental defense up. Uh, speed. Max HP again. There we go. Trying to finish it before Saturday. After I get the first game on my Switch, I'll probably... Oh, delete, like, the Edgeworth game, I'm guessing, from your phone. Uh, physical damage while guarding. Friendly fire. Um. You know what? Yeah, why not? Why not? Got a lot of weird healing stuff. And a guard. Okay, how's everyone else? Oh my god, I really have not been in here in a while. I have 55 things to spend. Punisher mode. Uh. Yeah, it's very pricey. It's very, very pricey. That's the thing as well, kind of going back to the question of the day. It, it can be expensive trying to get like original old games on their original platforms. Okay, that- oh, you know what? That is with Yuffie, and I don't have one with her yet, so... Oh, Finn, are you feeling any better? I think you said you were sick the other day, right? Oh, uh, Max and he... Well, limit gauge, like Tifa's pretty good at staggering enemies. She does it a lot for me usually. That's a great rate. Sounds nice. Ability though. Previous Wii U eShop is closed down. So it makes it harder to get games now. Yeah, I understand why though. You know, they're not going to continue to support something for 
for like that that long. Uh, yeah, you know what? Why not? Slowly but surely getting better. That's what I like to hear. Magic defense. That sounds nice for you. Uh, sure. Almost there, trying to forget. I, I should have done this before stream. I did not realize this was a thing. I um, have been playing Kingdom Hearts 1 on uh, on Steam recently. And um, I've been playing it a different way than I normally do. I chose the, the magic route is not something I've really ever done before, I don't think. Um, HP, mental defense. Uh, the other thing I'm trying to do, and the keyword here is trying, is there's an achievement for beating Kingdom Hearts 1 in under 15 hours. And like, if you're skipping cutscenes, Kingdom Hearts 1 is a very short game. It's not very long. Um, and I'm really close to being able to do it. I don't know if I'll actually make it though. We'll see. I've started to kind of run into some roadblocks towards the end. Make a hot water bottle. No worries. Take your time. Alright, and finally, so Red has a new collar, so we need to remember to use that skill. Uh, we could put that on him, this one. The Outlaw Bangle is a pretty nice boost to defense, actually. Oh, so is Road Warrior. Let's throw that on you. Uh, and while I am here, uh, let's make sure that we grab our fire and ice off cloud and our lightning and wind off cloud so that we have access to those. So I don't need that. Oh, yeah, I try to, like, honestly, I try to just ignore the timeline. <laughs> Actually, wait a minute. Let's try. So this can prevent us from being... Uh, poison, that might be... I can't remember if there's still poison in here. I know in the original there is. I'll put it on just in case. Uh, okay, we have precision defense, boy fix. Time has fun, but the splits, why are there splits? I like, I get why, I just don't like to deal with it. <laughs> like an ATP boost there. Uh, and then you know what? Instead of this, I'm gonna grab an assess. Yeah, I think the first split I can think of is like Ocarina of Time, like child timeline, adult timeline. Ganon wins timeline, I think it is. Alright, let's see. Reduces damage. 
Increases the limit gauge charge rate upon staggering a foe. Life. Okay, revival. You know what? I mean, to slow and stop. That sounds nice. Okay, Barret. We have going on for you. I still need to go back and do some more Titan. Or, uh. Not Titan. Uh. Summon fights. I've been really lazy about it. Poison, boarding, magnify, and fire. Okay. Oh, uh, you know what? I think Barrett's doing pretty good. Oh, and he also has a Sess on, too. Um, I'll leave him with what he currently has. Like the Vengeance Gauge. Oh, okay, it's this one. And I'm gonna set this to assess. There we go. I think we are ready. <laughs> it's just been a minute. It's fine. Alrighty. Make sure that you are well prepared. Oh, we are so prepared. I think. You gonna watch my back? Yep. Earning holes in you right now. <laughs> what is this? This is a place of deep sorrow. A place where those who have been sealed away are left to mourn their fates. Um. I can't remember what I was about to say. But what I will say it's due to that is something I wish they had brought over from the original, and I don't think they have it here, at least not as far as I'm aware. Uh Oh no, they have something here. Although I don't think it's quite the same. So you can like swap material between characters on this screen, which is nice. But in the original, you could swap like the entire set of materia between characters instead of one at a time. Which was really nice for when the game forced you to do it. I think they should bring that back because they do it a lot in this game where they do actually force you to, to someone who you're not used to using. Paul, oh, welcome back. Has your back been acting up? Oh, sorry about that. All right. We got you got to die. Just you just locked yourself up into another. Let's see. As if I weren't going to a fire. Kiss my ass. Barrett. Spells. Feel the shit hurts, don't it? Did I not do uh. that right? Get your paws off of me. <sighs> Oh, there we go. Okay, you just like toggle it. You find it already? No. Oh no, it did. Okay, that's what I want is to hit both of them. I think we did all right back there. She could save your load, so you could switch back after these sections. Yeah. You're in pain. Oh, I'm sorry. People aren't doing so good. I swear it does hurt. Don't rub it in. Monarchy, look here. <sighs> Such walls should be well within your power to climb. Yep. So this is, um, one of the things they advertise for this game is pretty much all the main party members have, like, some sort of gimmick to them, right? Some sort of, like, something they can do that the others really can't. I think they said Yuffie's was just being able to grapple hook, but, like, other characters do it too. <laughs> but yeah, this is something for, uh, for Red. Yeah, if you sleep weird. Your back and hips have also been really painful. Really sorry you all aren't feeling so great today. This place has given me the creeps. Your discomfort is only natural. A fierce battle was waged here. And even after 45 years, the scars remain fresh. 
What? You're saying the Gi managed to make it all the way up here? <laughs> okay, oh. somebody fill me in. Who are the Gi? These the friends. tribe known to very few people outside of the Vale. The rest you will learn in due time. Of that you can be certain. For now, let us proceed. Oh, sorry, Finn. As warm and toasty as it is in here right now, I do not like winter. <laughs> I'll, I'll keep this, thank you. Also, these guys are not nice in the original. Well, oh, arguable oh, here. No stopping me. Uh, okay. You got this. Pressure, All then. right, watch and learn. Sorry. Like shit hurts, don't. Yeah. Yeah. mine. <laughs> Time for a serious ass whooping. Benjamin, what do you have to eat? You got this. Don't worry about it. Sorry, please. Bring it home. End of the line. Ah. Ain't got nothing on me. First thing about pac is that there are so many potential sources that it's nearly impossible to zero in on one source, for me at least. Yeah. These really had legs for days. They did. Sorry, where did I come in from? From up there. Okay. Protein waffles and bacon. Oh, yummy. Hey, where'd you run off to? I'm up here breaking boxes, living my best feral pupper life. Damn, if that doesn't look convenient. I could go for some turkey bacon. Not normal, just turkey. <laughs> but yeah, those monsters in the original, they like, they did a stupid amount of damage for absolutely no reason. Um, and they could like wipe you out if you weren't prepared for them. Usually when I run into them, I just try to use all my big, like, limits and everything. Summons. Aqualong, all those good things. I knew the hectic side of you would come out. Make sure there's nothing up top. That doesn't look like it. I like chicken bacon, but now I can't find it in stores anymore. I don't think I've even had chicken bacon. I also like turkey pepperoni as well. Okay, more of our big scooter friends. Hey, Bring Rebecca, welcome home. How's I hope your work day was good. You're all the same thing, right? Yeah. Sorry. Just getting started. Good to go? Yeah, I'll do it. Still here. Feel me, forward and bring it home. All right, my time to shine. Please. Oh, weird. I didn't hit that one. You ain't gonna get away. Won't be nothing left to you when I'm through. Well, huh. oh, silver, yeah, absolutely. To reach their own. I think Mike prefers regular bacon, like pork bacon as well, but he usually just eats whatever I'm eating. <laughs> Important question, what kind of sandwich? <laughs> oh, you know what, actually speaking of bacon, it's the one thing, the one solitary thing I missed from my old job, was there was this cafe just outside, and my boss had a deal with the owner, where all of our food was here, you know. um, paid for by the company, so we could just go in and get like breakfast sandwiches or whatever, for free. 
um, they made like the best uh, BLT, but like with egg and avocado ever. It was so, oh, those are legs. It was so tasty. Oh my God. I miss it. I, I put on a lot of weight working there. <laughs> Oh, I'm hungry, Chad. I'm sorry. Yeah, it, it was it was a lot. You're ordering pizza for dinner? We were we were bad. We had McDonald's yesterday, but neither my mom nor I want to do any cooking. How fear me? Have I learned this skill yet? I have not. Okay. It's hard to tell when you're going to attack me. <laughs> hey, hey, no, no, someone pay attention to me. Why you? Ow. Come on. Do it. Try doing it. File it on. I don't think I can like go into vengeance mode on my own. Yeah. Ain't got nothing on me. Yeah, McDonald's here has gone up really high in price, too. We don't get it as often as we used to, which is probably for the best, but... I near fry reheated chicken. Or KFC shredded to sell a small garden dressing for dinner last night. Ooh! Mom just said to me this morning, I want pizza for dinner, and I was like, I'm not going to argue against that. <laughs> yeah, there's supposed to be the cheap option. Like, easily, and it's, you know, of course there's going to be additional fees for, like, Uber Eats, DoorDash, whatever. Hey, where'd you run off to? Um, but when Mike and I order, you know, it's just two combo meals, it can come close to 50 Canadian. Like, that's insane. Nowhere is cheap these days. No, really. Uh, okay. Oh, I thought there was a way up here. Easy. Not good enough. There we go. That's what I was looking for. But don't count me out yet. Going in. Still You're fine. Ever got to learn. Now. And that's that. Come on. Sorry. Here goes. Let's get out. Hell yeah. Never read out unless it's one of our birthdays. Yeah. Basically, some mayo thingy with curry in it. Very yellow. Sounds tasty. Tuesday's Pizza Hut does a deal here, two large pizzas for $20. Yeah, we, if we order anything these days, more often than not, it's pizza. I think the only downside is, it's like a downside, but an upside. Damn, if that doesn't look convenient. Because we always get a deal like that, where it's like two big pizzas, and it's just Mike and myself usually eating it. Um, there, uh, there's pizza for days. And like, I just feel greasy and gross after, and just... Skin doesn't like it. Hey, where'd you run off to? Okay, where am I going? Am I going down still? Fair being a dad. I know every time I leave his sight, he's like, Where are you going? <laughs> I know, it's very, very cute. I think now that he know, um, actually wait, does he know how old Red actually is? Or like, 
mentally how old he actually is. I don't think he was there for that conversation. Well. Oh no. Oh, true. Alright, watch and learn. <sighs> you got this. Yeah, they said it last stream, but I thought it was just Aerith and Tifa who were there for the conversation. Pile it on. Fuck on this. Don't let me go. Need my help, do you? Friends of the Zoo Dance are very good on the too. Very conservation focus. I love that. I hope you have fun. And there you have it. I don't think Barrett knows the specific age, but he knows he's younger, though, obviously, by the voice. <laughs> Rebecca, your, your little job for stream. I absolutely love it. I appreciate it. I only got two legs here, you know. Okay, I think that just goes back up. Oh, right. I think I did this in a weird order last time. What the hell is that? That is a key. It's huge. <laughs> Under normal circumstances, I would stress that you mustn't judge a book by its cover. For the key, however, they are as fearsome as their appearance implies. These are the things that killed my mom? Nanaki, this shall be your first trial. You are to explore this place. Understand the nature of its history. Okay, will do. Seek the relic of our past. Carry it forth, and bring the truth to light. Only then shall the path reveal itself unto you. Uh, Elton, you're an object to grab it with your mouse, release the button to drop it. Initiating combat will also cause you to automatically drop a held item. Grab the Gi artifacts scattered around the cavern and ask Boo and Hagen to inspect them. So I think some of them can start battles if I'm remembering this right. I don't think so. Um, they really gave the Gi a bit more character in this. They're not just this other tribe that attacked Cosmo Canyon in this. They have lore to them, which is kind of neat. Welcome back, Ace. Nay. That is not the relic we seek. <laughs> that is but a mere bone. But I found... I found it. Be proud of me. Oh. Memories of war. The hour of our awakening draws nigh. Well, if it isn't a key arrow... Its point is coated with a poison that rapidly circulates through the body, slowing the wounded until they are completely turned to stone. Had to tell her about investigations. Yeah. So exciting. Really something I didn't think would happen, but I think um, re-releasing the original Ace Attorney games and then the uh, Polo games and the uh, in, uh, Greatest Attorney Chronicles games has done a lot to bring more people in. Nay, that is not the relic we seek. Oh. Oh, oh. oh, sorry. I haven't slept well of late. Yeah, I'm gonna try to pick up everything because I, I can't remember where all the important stuff is, per se.
Look at him. He's so cute. He's like, look what I found. Oh. Oh. Uh, uh, there we go. I don't like that. Uh, movement. He Most got a ball. Call that materia, but it is far more than a magic stone. It is a crystallized collection of the planet's memories and knowledge. Brings bones and toys back like a good baby. Also, I'm not gonna lie, I wasn't expecting another, like, new Zelda game ah, for yes. such a long time. An armament of the Fey. The carvings on its hilt should look familiar. Indeed, you'll find the very same markings on your own body. Oh, there we go. That's a new, uh, weapon, I guess, for us, or collar. Yeah, I mean, it's not, you know, on the same scale as, um... Here's the kingdom of Breath of the Wild, obviously, but it still looks phenomenal. Um, and I'm really happy they're using that style again. So I think this is the important one. Ah, a remnant of our struggles, of our desires. The new switch you, but I'm ready. You just got a nice drop. Nice. What do you get? Didn't they finish the Kingdom of Wild before they released it? Yeah, no, that's also very true. I remember hearing that they finished it pretty much when they were like, hey, we need a little bit more time, and they just spent the last year, like, polishing it. Oh, I'm not in control anymore. Okay. Get rid of that thing! Huh? <laughs> we're gonna get out. Who wakes us from our slumber? I like how Buganagan just doped out. He's like, I'm not even gonna say anything, I'm Stop just leaving. It up oh. <laughs> can't remember what y'all are weak gotcha. to. Your mind. Just getting I guess the wrong button. Let's use infinite air and earth rooms. You still kind of, but it's most of the collection block being filled. Oh, nice! I do love a nice collection log. In any game. Okay, you are also weak to fire. Uh, oh yes, or hitting them with healing spells will pressure them. They spin their spears to deflect all ranged physical attacks. Sick Like playing with fire? I'm out! Keep it together. Going in. Here goes. Uh, damn it. Why does red sound different? So, gotcha. same voice no actor mercy, and everything, right? but they, uh, he kind of had a big moment. A <laughs> he feels a bit more at home being himself. Even in death, their lingering enmity manifests as such. They who wander in search of retribution. That's kind of pathetic. Do not be so quick to denigrate your enemies, nor make light of their plight. Consider this statue. It has been placed in this chamber for a reason. Handle it with the utmost care. I will. Deliver unto us the remnants of our past. I just need to heal really quick. Yo, oh, actually, you know, while I'm in here, it's a bit of a waste of the second one, but it's fine. Eh, eh, there we go. Also, question of the day for anyone who maybe missed it earlier. Um, 
do you still play and buy games for older consoles? I can still use that even when I'm not in vengeance mode. Can I just like learn it? Oh, I can! Well, that makes things a lot faster. Okay, let's equip that new collar then. Right, it's a pretty boy and he deserves all the best. Uh, deplete the vengeance gauge to increase allies' ATB. Potency proportional to amount expended. I play stuff on my older consoles, but I won't buy more games. Buy no play sometimes. Mostly through newer consoles, they're fair. Not unfamiliar with selling the high season emulation, that's all I'll say. <laughs> fair enough. Oh, these aren't gonna be linked. Uh Stu's freaking out over the Marvel vs. Capcom collection on Twitter. I had a feeling he'd be really, really happy with that direct. Uh, the second I saw that, he was the first one I thought of. Oh. Heh. <laughs> you know what I forgot, chat? Guess what I forgot? The statue. <laughs> There we go. I forgot the toy. <laughs> I forgot the stick. All right then. Are these altars? Interesting. Cause my first thought was, are we gonna make it out of this place alive? <laughs> its decor is indeed the opposite of inviting. These look like the statue I picked up. If there is a reason for everything, then one could argue that everything has no reason. Regardless, you know what you must do, don't you? Deliver unto us the remnants of our past. Restore them to their rightful place. Go. Oh, right, these names kind of caught my eye too, I think, my first playthrough. That was the ruby one. Is there something for Barrett here too? Yeah. Okay. Marlene, Daddy loves you. <laughs> that it? <laughs> Not in the least. Uh, Y'all seem to want to go this way, so let me grab that. So let's just call the Amber. That's not as interesting. Does he say something different? You both seem to want to go this way, even though there's stairs up there. Those stairs don't go anywhere. Understood. <laughs> Something like come and get it. A bit more confident then, maybe. This might be a good spot to find some ingredients. If you enjoy sipping livestream, then yes. 
Mind you, I always... I don't know what I think it smells like. But I always imagine it wouldn't be very tasty. There might be treasure up top of those stairs. I'll have to check when we get back. Also, let me do a hydrate here. I've been having energy drink all day. I'll have water. If not sippy, why sippy God? I don't think Mike had heard like that. It's not like a phrase per se, but you know what I mean. Hadn't heard something like that before. And I think if not, I said, if not friend shaped, or if not friend, why friend shaped in regards to uh, opossums. And he was like, what? <laughs> they are friend shaped. Right. Yes. Hello. I'm just gonna- oh, those boxes do be floating. There you go. Can't have no floating boxes. Hello, you wouldn't mind if I just happened to, uh, yoink. Red, red, you're meant to yoink. Emerald. Hmm. <laughs> Be nice. Hey, listen. Yes. Come closer. That we may have our vengeance. <laughs> there we go. Oh, I forgot to set it to the Let's new go. thing. Oh, I need boats for it? Oh, that kind of sucks. Say, can I pet that dog to an animal you know you can't pet? <laughs> it's just a danger pet. Uh, all right, really quickly, look at how cute he is. Look at him, cleaning his face. Just so much easier for me to focus if I have it there. All right, don't forget the emerald statue. I wonder if the weapons are still going to be called, like, Ruby, Diamond, Emerald, I mean, Ultima as well, but... Because I don't think they... they just call them weapons in this, they don't really give them, like, a set name. But I did see when they were in the live stream with Tifa there, I think the two of them had different colors. Uh, you know what, actually, before I do this, put that down. Check the stairs. Going to Robert Irwin, wombats are dangerous, but that's a risk I'm willing to take for the pets. The Vale is intertwined with the Gee, for they first came to these lands many millennia ago. This sanctuary is proof of their persistence, for it was built to ensure that they never escaped. But if they were sealed away thousands of years ago, how'd they break out and attack the Vale? That I cannot answer. Only the Gee themselves could. But enough about them. You are here to learn about yourself, Nanaki.
Who this cave them? serves as a boundary between our world and that of the Gi. It was vital to them and their plans. Were the Gi to seize control of it, the canyon would be doomed. And the people. When the Gi moved against us yet again, a certain watcher recalled this vulnerability. Huh? Since time was of the essence, he entered the cave without reinforcements. As he had feared, it was teeming with Gi, ready to descend upon the village. Determined to protect the Vale, he pounced from one foe to the next, felling all who dared oppose him. Hold on. If there was a Watcher who single-handedly saved the canyon, how come I've never heard of them? <laughs> For now, you should focus on your own struggles with the Gi. Their malice grows more potent. Is that the name of this song, Rebecca? I was always uncertain if the red liquid in the cave of the Gi in the original was meant to be blood or meant to be like some sort of like lava or something. I guess that answers that. <laughs> Let's go swimming. No, I'm good. Random, don't you? Do you swim? I feel like you didn't. Or you, or you not very well, at least. I can't remember. We need, we need to put floaties on you before we go down there. You sink. Okay, we, yeah, we need floaties. Oh, okay. Gotcha. Definitely got ambiance. Uh. Do not allow fear to take hold of your heart. You are your own master, Nanaki. You and no one else. Never forget that. Look to the crevasse and the gates beyond. Pass through all to complete your trial. But that's easier said than done. Okay. This area, I think it's just the general, like, colors and kind of like the atmosphere reminds me a lot of the Fire Temple in Tears of the Kingdom. In the depths and everything, it's just, the vibes are, are the same. Hello, friends. Here goes. No stopping. Let's see ya. Sorry to put this All on right. you. Watch and learn. Oh, this is an opportunity. Don't look now. Ain't no thing. Gotcha. Oh. Only the watcher's work is never done. Confirm as Australia, and they are hostile. Get back into some form of shape. The gym on the cruise taught me that while I can still do a majority of what I could years ago, I need work. Yeah, easing yourself back into it, you know, maybe not rushing back in so you don't hurt yourself. Well, these are weird looking, aren't they? What are you? Ready? You got this! My turn? How's this? Wait, yeah. are these meant to be those face enemies that are, pop up in uh Corel Prison? Or I've never noticed what they were meant to be, I don't think. <laughs> okay, you don't like ice. Pressured when suggesting their opponent take a gamble, hitting them with a powerful offensive ability this time will spin the roulette. Enhancing or enfeebling their assailant depending on which face they land. Did you 
see me in action? All right, that went well. Um, where am I going? <laughs> Have I? I've been here. Okay, that's where I started. Yes, I see this. Okay. All right. So that means we are gonna go this way. Uh, all right. That's there, but that is probably for Barrett. <laughs> Ain't no walking away from this. <laughs> Going in, coming at ya. Your save is still there. Oh, nice. No going easy. It'd be really good if you got it all. No mercy, all right. You know, sorted. Kicking it up a notch. How's this? There. Now, you're mine. Fuck on me. I love how much more vocal Red is now. Now, you shivering yet? Let's end this. Tear into him. Gotta love it. There. Bring us staggered. Let me show you what a watcher can do. Want the ball? Okay, let's shake a leg. Yeah, he can be himself finally. Uh, okay, so you're nearly there, Barrett. But when the heck did I get that? Whoops! All oh, right, I got this from the side quest yesterday, and I never put it on. Okay, we got to spend some time with Barrett. Consume all ATB charges, deliver a close range attack, and send enemies flying. Awesome, cool. Uh. Swap these around. Just told Lucy that the mouse at her games are getting a collection. She's excited. Yes. They're so good. Has she played uh, any of the Eats Train games or uh, was it just watching the anime? So how are we supposed to open this thing? How indeed? I guess Lanarchy. Oh, no, that's the wrong L2. That was an R2. Hi! <laughs> how resourceful you Boy, Vincent. Need to replay it, honestly. So good. And like, the, it, there's there's so much more accessible now. Is it a good time to save? Heck yes it is. I always appreciate a save. Reminder. I was going to buy the first trilogy on PS4 before I left for home. Oh, that's really nice of you. I hope she enjoys. Okay, uh... Come closer, that we may have our vengeance. Beat this! That just like eat through my HP. You ain't gotta be like that. Say your prayers and beg for forgiveness. And there you have it. Go. This music gives me slight, um, 
Uh, I didn't mean to do that. Uh, slight ball guys you 15? No, not 15, 16 vibes actually. I think it's just the, the music and the, uh, and the voices. That was overkill, do it again. <laughs> I'm not gonna miss anything on my way through. We already got the two weapons, so I'm pretty happy with that. Oh, <gasps> what sort of pie? You can't just say that. You need to tell me what sort of pie. Here goes. End of the line. Sorry. Time to get serious. Good to go. About damn time. Let me go. Oh, you in trouble now? No more of that, please. Hit. Oh, I should have changed Barrett's thing. I'm coming for you! Fuck on this! You're up! Don't worry about it. Here goes! Gotcha! Now, fear me! You shivering yet? Going in! Never mind! Got him now. Did I do good or did oh, I do good? Oh, it's like a little mini pie. That sounds really tasty. If I didn't put it, that would fall back down. I know, a new on Barrett here a little bit. Poor guy's really behind. You know what? And this is, like, coming from, obviously, a huge Luigi's Mansion fan. I'm really happy, like, half the direct was not showcase for the Luigi's Mansion too, because I know sometimes they do that. Mind you, it's not like a brand new game or anything. But I was a little worried they were going to do something like that. We beat them. Have you now? In what sense? They have yet to truly pass on, and their rage remains unquenched. Come. Let us keep pressing forward. We're very nearly there. Yeah, so it was it was overall good. Um, but yeah, you're right. They haven't actually shown any of the bosses. I really don't like, um, in particular, the ice boss in that game. I think it's really obnoxious. I'm hoping... See, it's wrong one. I'm hoping... Uh, the... I don't know, just like playing it with a proper controller, not like on the 3DS, is gonna make a difference somehow. But yeah, that ice boss is obnoxious. I think well, Safian loved the attention he got from the kids, but I didn't realize he was just a kid trying to pretend to be a tough guy. Yeah, he's he's a baby. He is a baby. Yeah. 
we go. All right, so everything has been mastered except for Barrett's brand new weapon. Yep, yeah, he's like, was it 48, I think? But still big. Okay, Barrett, uh, grab your new one, which is smack down, strike the ground and send nearby enemies flying. And before I forget as well, it's so much easier this way. I didn't do this in my initial playthrough until like the very end. So like I go into the menu and have to uh, go down all the options every single time. This makes it so much easier. Uh, okay. Look at the smackdown on all of their candy asses. This reminds me of those altars. <laughs> there is a similarity, yes. But this sanctum is much more ancient and serves a rather different purpose. The altars we came upon before were built to imprison the key. This, however, was built to provide the Cetra with a means to commune with them. Commune with them? Why would the Cetra do that? The Gi were the enemy. <laughs> Good and evil friend and foe. Dichotomy is not set in stone, as mutable as the winds. But for now, Monarchy, let us concentrate on the matter at hand, clearing a path to the truth. Yeah, I won't say too, too much about that just right now. Um, but what I will say is I really appreciate, again, they've given the Gi a lot more character. And they've also um, found in the Setra and gave them a lot more character as well. Okay, so there's that but there's also like all this yeah and it, like especially the citro like you knew about them you knew Eris was the last one um they could talk to the planet so on and so forth but like it it wasn't really anything substantial you know Apparently, I could have been here before, and I don't know how. Yeah, it's very different. It's very, very different than what I, I thought they would do. Because uh, you kind of see a little bit of it in, like, one of the earlier trailers they put out for this game. They, there's a Gi talking about the Black Materia. I thought that was an entirely different character. Um, I thought they were someone from the Temple of the Ancients, but they weren't, so. Hey, where'd you run off to? Yeah, no, it makes sense, but it's just a little different. Uh, okay, so there's Materia up here. That's interesting. I guess we have to do it alone. Can I just not be here? here oh go. god. Alright, I'm here. Hi. You're mine. There. How's this? Time to get serious. Uh, I pressed the wrong button. Going sure, great depth. Since they call me a good and evil at the same time, still leaving room for characters that are just unapologetically, unapologetically evil like Hojo. Yes. Yeah, there's never going to be any any redemption for him, and I feel comfortable knowing that. No mercy, all right? I'm fired up now. No going easy. Got him now. Going in, please. What the? Whoopsies. Don't take it personally, all right? 
also have no clue what you're all discussing, but I'm just gonna stay intentionally blind because Let's someday I'll play and I'll still feel fresh. Exactly, and then suddenly things are gonna click if you remember our conversations. The work is never done. I hope one day you do play it though, it's a lot of fun. There's still some context missing from the game. I won't say anything until that's clear. Got you. Yeah. Um, we'll definitely talk about stuff when, when that happens. Yeah, exactly. We gotta be kind of selective about what we're saying here. You have your theories. Damn, if that doesn't look convenient. Still a third, uh game that I play. I just want to play through all at once. Yeah, you're not the only one doing that. That's very fair. A lot of people are just like, yeah, I'll just wait. Oh. Uh, what am I missing here? Oh, here we go. Yeah, I would be able to vouch. That's actually... Uh, very true. That's something instantly pop into my head when going through the spit but I may be way off. Okay. All right, I'm interested to hear when we get to uh, to a point where we can talk about it. Or you're like me and buy the game, start multiple times and not go further than the end. Okay, so to be fair, to be fair, I did the exact same thing with Persona. It took me like five or six different attempts. I've gone through the beginning of Persona 5 so many times. <laughs> um, and then one day, I don't know what it was, it just stuck. And that's okay, It'll, you'll get there. I believe. I don't know, actually, I'm gonna leave that to you because... I don't know what it is you want to talk about, but I'm assuming... If it's spoiler-ish, we can wait till you think it's safe. Steam release, yeah. Uh, Sounds like crying. Oh, oh, oh. As with good and evil, sorrow too assumes many forms. Forty-five years ago, a watcher fought his way here alone, and in his bravery took upon himself the burden of our hope. I guess we could talk about that then, too. Oh. I really love these, like, totally not vending machine vending machines. I find them very funny. Have work today, so I'll be able to see all the fields present. Oh, nice! There's gonna be some fields, for sure. For sure. We have to guess the name of the boss theme for you. Okay. Yep, we're gonna do a big old save, of course. Thank you for the reminder. Hmm, it's, I, could, I could see where you'd think that for sure. I'm gonna be a little quiet though. <laughs> kind of cheating looks at stuff up since I'm missing a lot of context. Oh, got you, yeah. No worries then, no worries. 
Um. Just trying to think if there's anything else I should be setting up here. I can't really remember. I know what we're going up against, but I don't remember exactly what it's weak to. No. What is it? <gasps> oh, this Their is where I had it. Manifests once more. I had an error in my original save. I. I've Message it to a couple other people about it. Um, I guess I can talk about it after. Why the hell this thing pissed it up? That was a good one. Time to get serious. Ow, ow. You remember that? Yeah, it's weird, right? Is is it getting attacked by any chance? Why you? Okay. Uh, inflicting enough damage will pressure him. A curse will activate when the Soul of Flames possess a statue. Half HP, half MP. Deplete ATB. Shrink battlefield. Staggering gain attack will undo the curse. Doom will inflict instant death after a certain amount of time. Right. There we go. Get my vengeance mode going. Yes, it's my turn. Asshole. Okay, so you are pressured. Don't say I didn't want it! I really like to blow this guy off that mouth at least. Please! Almost had me there! Cool to attach to Aaron. I get it. Bring your might to bear! Oh. Oh, okay, never mind. I actually, like, zeroed in on him. It's good to see. Barret, could you heal me? Uh, yeah, there we go. Need my help, do you? Bring in the heat. You're up. My turn. Gotcha. Now, staggered. Let's do. Uh, synergy first. I'm hoping to recreate the error I ran into, actually. We'll see. Oh, would it be this one? Or is it the next level? I can't remember. Thanks for the backup. I'm guessing not that one. Okay. Mm, sure Assess. Um. Uh, they'll possess a statue. Okay. Now it's your head, buddy. You know what, Barry? All right. Watch and learn. Well, it's up yeah. on this. See ya. <laughs> Hope you don't mind if I fill you full of holes. There we go. That's better. <laughs> Get your ass out of here! Get in the line! Jeez. Don't worry about it. Got you! Yeah, I'll do it! Fire in one off! 
I remember feeling that this boss is kind of like tanky. But obviously, playing on easy, I didn't have too much issue. Purely because I'm on easy, though, mind you. Oh? Uh, yeah, you know, why not? Let's have us some fun! Staggered again. Let's get this one. I'm ready to embrace my inner beast. Didn't really get him before this, yeah. Was it that Doom Timer that got you? I couldn't recreate the issue. I'll, I'll mention it in a little bit, though. Form evanescent, rancor everlasting. They might have. Well done. You've become quite the formidable fighter. <laughs> sure have. So, does this mean I passed the test? <laughs> I'm afraid that decision is not mine alone to make. <sighs> Let us consult with one more qualified. All right. Let's see if we passed. The time, it's it's almost time. There he is. The Watcher of the Vale fought valiantly and offered up his life in defense of our home. As you see, he still watches over us to this very day. Wait, is that... Seto? My father? No, there's no way. The poisoned arrows of the Gi transformed his body into stone. And there he has stood ever since, his watch eternal. Our savior. What about my mom? Did she know what had happened to him? Oh, why, of course she did. It was, after all, she and Seto who asked me to see her off the cave. But why? Why did she never tell me the truth? Because she knew that if she did, you would attempt to seek your father out all by yourself. Your parents strove to keep our veil safe. But there is one thing they fought even harder to protect. You, Nanaki, their son. She was afraid because I was too small and weak. <laughs> Back then, perhaps, but not anymore. Heavens no. You've become a fine warrior in your own right. And that is precisely why I brought you here. <laughs> oh, this song is not where your journey is meant to end, my dear boy. You must leave the veil once more. 
But I'm a watcher now. I gotta protect our home like he did. Listen to me, Mama Ki. When I first heard your friend's emphatic warnings, I dismissed them outright. No more than the ravings of misguided youths. When you've lived as long as I have, you start to believe you've seen it all. But no surprises remain. But I realize now how very foolish I have been. The eyes that I thought saw the world clearly have grown blind to new possibilities. But... I would hate to impede your progress any further. I bid you leave, Nanaki. Before, like me, you become inured to your own ignorance. With sharper eyes and keener ears, go forth and in my stead seek the great truths of our world. Look after him for me. Don't worry. We will. You failed this trial, my boy. Continue your training and try again. Are you up to the task, Nanaki? You bet I am. After all... I am Nanaki, watcher of Cosmo Canyon, and son of Seto, protector of our veil. Barrett, buddy, put on those glasses. <laughs> It'll be okay. Hearken unto me. My name is Guy Natak. O oh, brave and noble Seto, I beseech you once more, hear the urgent pleas of my people. My thanks, Seto. You are as magnanimous as ever. The warrior Nanaki, and you, the Cetra. Come with me. That was... Oh, an exciting turn of events indeed. We'll back you up to thou. Uh Ah, smirk. You see that? I want to hit him. No. This one's free. No 2k. Alright, so now I can actually tell you guys what the issue was. Um, so yeah, that that's Red's kind of main story, is he thought his father uh, abandoned him, his people, his mom, and ran away, but in reality he was the one protecting everyone. Um, and... When I was doing that big boss fight in my first playthrough, I can't remember if I boosted Red's limit one level or two. It might have been two. I don't remember. Um, but pretty much he said a very interesting line. It was something along the lines of this one's for you, dad, or something like that. But obviously that was just before he would have known that his dad wasn't a coward and, you know, he actually was someone to look up to. Um, and I think it's just a matter of 
um, I think his name is Max Middleman, I think it's the guy, uh, who does Red's voice acting. They had him do, like, different, obviously, the, the deeper voice and the, and the more kid voice uh, for Red. So there's different lines he'll do in those voices for, like, limits and stuff. And I think for some quests, too, from what I've heard. Um, and yeah, it was just, it just played because he was using his kid voice, so. <laughs> Going to the cave of the Gi in Cosmo Canyon with Red and Barrett during the boss fight. Use the synergy ability, yet that raised their limit levels when I used Red's higher limit. He said something along the lines of, give me your strength, Dad. Yep, that was it. That was my message to, uh, to Itsu. Uh, but yeah, I thought it was funny, and I'm like, oh, <laughs> I shouldn't have heard that, but, you know. Yuffie's just like, are we going? Are we going? Um, which we will go, but we need to go on a stretch break first. If y'all would like to join me, get up, stretch, grab a drink, grab a snack, do what you gotta do. Be back in about 10 minutes. Uh, I'm gonna go get myself something to eat, because I'm hungry. Um, be back real soon. I could find my button. There it is. <laughs> 